said, darling, you are all I want for sure Darling, you give me everything and more I said, darling, ooh, ooh, ooh yeah, girl, you know I miss you to my channel for those of you who don't know me my name is Gugu I am also known as Sne and as Gugu Kuleji on all my social media platforms feel free to follow me because I really do drop some premium content and that's on period to all my returning subscribers my day ones my VIP gig 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 thank you so much for coming back for yet another video and if you're new here and you're seeing my face for the first time and you're thinking to yourself who is this gorgeous gorgeous hun my name is Gugu I hope you stay I hope you fall in love and I definitely definitely hope you hit that subscribe button and become part of my family welcome to a new vlog guys I feel like my face is so shiny but it doesn't matter because we are back me and my husband went out um, to create content and ended up oh couple of them my armpit is itchy anyway I was saying me and my husband went out to create content 
for Instagram, guys. I want to be stressed about Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, here's my handle. Please do follow me. Uh, you guys saw the outfit I was wearing. I went with all black with a bright red lipstick. And then initially, we really just went there to take pictures. I wanted to take pictures outside. Some were cute, some were nice. And then uh, my husband was like, hmm, since we're here, we might as well eat. <laughs> So we decided uh, we ended up having um, lunch and then now we are back home. I have some editing to do for a campaign that I'm going live with on. <sighs> I have to submit tomorrow. You know what? That is my problem, ne? But I just wanted to welcome you guys and say hi. How are you? Welcome to a new vlog. Please make sure that you are subscribed if you're enjoying my content. If you love my content, please, please hit the subscribe button. I am so excited. We're almost on 110,000. Like we've gained an extra 10,000 subscribers since we hit 100k. I'm so excited about that. Thank you so much for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, check right now subscribe we are doing 150k um this year and also i wanted to address a question that i've been getting so much regarding before i address that question i'd like to say thank you so much for the positive feedback on the house hunting journey honestly failure makes you scared like I, I, I was so scared but with your encouragement in the comment section everyone just saying please take us with um try again god is there like you guys gave me strength because now i had so much anxiety i'm thinking what if we fail again what if we don't get the house again what if um what if what what if but everything that you guys said in the comment section all your encouragement all your prayers guys thank you so much really really appreciate it um uh, we are taking you guys on the journey like uh, no question I'm even doing it with so much confidence because I feel like I have so many prayers behind me I have prayer warriors behind me that are my subscribers I have so many people rooting for us and I am not fearing if we fail we fail but I'm, I'm, I'm like we're doing this with a positive a mindset that we're gonna come through God is there God is alive he won't let us down and if it's not time it won't be time but yeah i just want to say thank you so much thank you so much uh we definitely there'll be a house viewing in this vlog uh what else did i want to say oh i've been getting a lot of questions regarding the paneling because we did changes in this house right on my dms on instagram family asking like even people are asking like people in my life are asking so what are you gonna do with the paneling like what are you guys gonna do because the paneling looks so nice so now i wanted to change the house back to how we found it check out the paneling and um paint the green because it's just a green thingy and the parts where we paneled take them out and then fix them get someone to do that obviously however the agent and the house owners were like we love it we love it if you don't mind please um leave it as it is uh, you'll get your full deposit back and uh yeah and also they wanted the chairs in the kitchen they asked if do you mind leaving the chairs <laughs> and i understand even the i even offered to give them the lights obviously they have to pay for the chairs i'm not gonna charge for the paneling guys because no one asked me to do the paneling it was me who wanted to do it so i'm not gonna charge for that uh, so it's gonna be free to them whoever buys the house but i'm gonna charge for the chairs they wanted the frames and the lights and the fr and the lights in the bedroom as well i'm gonna charge for that so that i can buy um more or whatever i decide because i don't know where i'm going i don't know <laughs> yeah we're basically homeless but yeah god is alive so to everyone who was asking guys nama was shocked that people would love this so much and they want to keep it uh, i won't be charging them for the paneling i'll just be charging for the furniture that they want but yeah i just wanted to quickly iron that out because i feel like it was on everyone's mind uh, on how we're gonna go, go about that i think even my mom my mom sent me a voice note she was like oh my god that paneling in that house it's so beautiful i can't believe it you leave you leaving it behind but yeah it's a risk we knew we knew that it wasn't forever but it was a learning curve at least now we know we can do e-paneling guys i don't want to make this intro too long <laughs> let me go work so that i don't waste this gorgeous gorgeous makeup 
and the same Lisana and the same Lisa. Oh, Mrs. Kanana, um, Fazka Elvin. No, let me not say that. Uh, what did I say in Kosa? Oh, Mazkali, oh, Mazkala, like a same Lisana. Okay, guys, um, don't skip the ads. Uh, I'll see you guys. Uh, what are we doing tomorrow? I don't know, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Morning, guys. Yeah. Uh, my husband is in the shower. I hope the shower is not making a noise. Um, I've been up since half three in the morning. Um, there's a thing about me, ne? When seasons change, it messes up my sleep. Like, when are summer's coming in or summer's going out, winter's coming in, autumn, yeah, when seasons change, I struggle to sleep so i've been up since half past three um i did some work i edited um a video that i'm doing a campaign for and now my husband is up he's taking a shower he's going to work so i am going to help him get ready for work i don't know what i'm doing today oh i know i'm going to do unboxings guys i've kept i feel like the shower is making noise um but i'm gonna tell you i'm going i have unboxings for days and i want to do that with you guys because it's different things um bought at different times some of them as a gift that my husband got me i'll show you guys so um let's go make breakfast so that because one thing about my husband he's quick like i think it takes him a max 20 minutes to get ready for work so and i'm slow even when i make food i'm slow when i iron i'm slow so let's do that and then we'll talk properly after he's um, going to work. Let's help Habi get ready for work. Tell me if I got it wrong, but you don't wanna be alone. Spend the evening by yourself, but you'll miss me when it's getting late. Got it all, babe. Save on when you're ready. So I'm done ironing my husband's clothes. I wanted to make him breakfast here at home. He's saying he doesn't want breakfast here. He's going to skip breakfast and then he is going to have lunch at work. So I'm going to make his lunch now. I'm 
would say we were good together I would say we had fun But our trails would never run forever you guys simply because of the headboard situation that I don't want to address <laughs> I've changed my headboard as you can see and I'm not sharing it with you because I don't like this one either I am <laughs> I am waiting for collection I'm waiting for them to come collect this headboard I hated it and I'm taking it back Anyway, I want us to unbox a few things. Four. It's four items uh, from different stores, purchased different days. I just saved them to show you, except one gift. It was a gift I had to open. It I was excited. It was a surprise for my husband. In fact, let me let me start with that. I unboxed it, guys. I was so I was so excited. I'm gonna put a clip here to show you guys because I wasn't vlogging on the day. But he bought me this Dolce and Gabbana fragrance. He knows I love it. I wanted to buy it when um, I was buying my Dolce and Gabbana. I'm gonna show you when I was buying my bag. But I was like, yo, I mind. I just spent so much money on this bag. I don't have money for a fragrance. And then he got it for me as a surprise. <laughs> it came with flowers. It came with a note. I was blushing, guys. Like, I'm so happy. Sorry, guys. My camera got full. I don't even remember what I was saying. Let me unbox the next item. The next item is this. I had a knife. Oh, here it is on the TV. Next item is from Zara. So these are this is um these are shoes. Now let me open them first. So this is a pair of shoes that I thought <laughs> I don't want to buy, but ended up buying. Ah. Sorry guys for the noise. Why do they look used, guys? 
They don't look new at all. Hmm. Let me turn down the brightness. Here are the shoes. It's a pair of white heels. Here are the shoes. I don't think you can see them properly. I'm just gonna use pictures um, to show you guys properly there from Zara. They, they look a bit, can you guys see that? Especially this one. They look like someone wore them or someone was trying them on and I bought them online. I don't know. Anyway, I saw, I'm gonna put a picture here. I first saw these shoes on Le Cousoyne back in Jan. It's April now, mid-April. And then Komoto came, was it Feb? And then she was telling me about these shoes. I'm like, I know those shoes. I saw them also on Le Cousoyne. She was like, I love them so much. I wanna get a pair. I'm not sure if she bought them. And then two weeks back, I see this girl and she styled them so nice. I was like, that's it. That's it, I'm buying. Because I kept saying, I have a pair of white heels. I have a pair of white heels. But when I saw them on that girl, I didn't even take a screenshot. I wish I took a screenshot of her page on Instagram. I was sold. I just bought them. So yeah, I'm happy. Okay, now for the last one. The last unboxing. I'm so excited for this, guys. Uh, I got myself something small at Burberry. It's nothing big, uh, but it's something that I really wanted. Let me check it out. I've already unboxed it. I've already worn it. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably have seen me. If you noticed anyway, it's nothing big, guys. It comes with a green just bag. You might have guessed it by now. <laughs> it's a belt. I had a replica of this belt. I'm gonna put a picture here. I had a replica of this belt and I sold it. So I have a black Gucci belt and I thought I'd be happy with and content with just one belt, but I felt like I needed a brown belt because a lot of my clothes are brown a lot of my stuff like bags brown and yeah so i decided to get a brown belt and because i enjoyed this belt so much when i had the replica one um replica fake i saw someone dragging me on twitter saying now that she's buying originals she doesn't call them um replicas anymore she calls them fakes i was like i don't even remember saying any of that but okay Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. So whichever word you guys are comfortable with. Replica, fake, it's all the same. So I got this one because I've had it. And what I love about this specific one is that it is reversible. And put it this side. And now you have a black Burberry bag. So it is reversible. Um, I wanted to buy brown. The brown one goes... The one that's not reversible goes for 8,000 rand. And then this one goes for, how much is this belt? It's a little bit more expensive than it is. Why am I showing you guys prices from the, um, the receipt? Let me show you. Uh, came with this. This. And then this is the price. Hope you guys can see. It's twelve thousand. Oh, I lighting yeah, like guys. I don't know if you guys can see. It's twelve thousand two hundred rand. Okay, guys, that's all I have for you for the unboxing. I'm going to cook. All right, let's make dinner.
<laughs> um, I'm gonna close off the vlog here for today. I'm using my front camera. I'm tired of quality. I've had a long day. Um, we ended up having visitors today. That's why I finished so late. Um, my sister-in-law and my brother-in-law. Yes, we we here. They flying out to on Monday, eh? They flying back to yeah to the UK on uh, Monday. So I finished cooking late because we, we even left the bus. We even left the house and came back. But yeah, exhausted. Just want to take a shower and then sleep. Uh, tomorrow we are viewing houses. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Say bye, my love. Bye, guys. Let me finish my food. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I don't like this dress, guys, because it keeps on going down, and I don't want that. Um, my skin is very shiny, so I'm just going to use my Huda Beauty powder to just. I was shooting a video for my she in haul so now we are going to go for a house viewing excited about it the hair wearing is from she in it's also in the she in video turn haul I started with the hair no glue don't say I don't plug you no glue at all just lift it and yeah okay baby I'm ready, let's go view our house. I'm Gugu. Hi, I'm Jane. Hi. Hi, Jane. This is my husband, Elvin. Hi. Very good. And there's only 22 units in the, the actual complex. Uh huh. Oh, no, this is the whole complex. This is it. Okay. It's it's big. <laughs> yeah, it's nice and. Oh, this is Are you interested in a three or a four bedroom? Three and four. Let's have it. I love this entrance thingy. So you've got the, the guest coat room downstairs. So your guests don't have to keep running up and down the stairs mm -hmm. every time they're in the bathroom. Uh huh. Let's Look see. at the finishings being on the on the. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. You can see inside there's a basin. Oh, check the basin. It's nice. Yeah. Oh. Why is it less? It's, it's, it's a small, it's smaller space. It's on the other side. It's on the road side. Oh. Oh, we really mean the road side. It's on the outside. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. So a lot of people prefer having it more to the inside. In my opinion, number six is my favorite one. <laughs> <laughs> so you've got your stepping doors that go out. You have got room for a small pool. If you want to put a small pool in, one of the units has already put their pool in. And because it's not sectional plywood, it's freehold. It's not a complex, it's, a, it's what they call it a security estate. Yeah. It's not a complex, it's a security estate. So you don't pay levies here? You pay what they call a homeowner's, which is about eight ninety a month. Okay. But you haven't got the high levies. Okay, okay. And you can always enclose this if you wanted to. Kitchen, does it have a scullery? Yes, it does. Oh, this is stunning. Oh my god, I think the kitchen is my favorite. How big is the um, under 250? 250. Yes, 
And I think the garden is 68.5. Oh. The coffee station here. Or bar. Or bar. <laughs> Either or. Whatever makes you happy. It's littered in half. Chop chop bar. Coffee. 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 Take both dishwasher and, and washing machine. And then for your microwave. This is the oven built in. Yes. Does know. it come with the, the new house? Does it come with the. Yes. My oven house. These are standard. Yes. And then your gas. Bottle. Yes. Is under the heat. Yes. And then the piping runs through here. Underneath, you can put a 9 kg in there. Oh, just here. So this is where oh. your connection point. Your connection point is for the house. Yes, for the gas. Yeah, it's gonna die. And then this this is a garage. Double garage. Oh, spacious. Oh, this I love this. I love this. And remember, let Jazzy go to the top. No levies. No transfer duties, but you buy directly from. From the Uh huh. And then get off our car. Straight into the kitchen. Okay, so we can go upstairs now. Mm -hmm. It will take us, Jay. I love the floor. Beautiful finishes. Mm -hmm. What's nice is this window. You get a lot of natural light coming through as well. And you'll notice your ceiling is a slightly higher than the normal ceiling. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it is higher. Is your family bathroom? I love this. Yes. To put in all the. Oh, the Do you want to come in? No, I can see from it. Yes. It has both shower and. Yes, shower and bath. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone's in there. Ah, I've always wanted a walk-in closet. Oh, that would nice. ah. have walk-in closets. Are you serious? The three and the four. Three and the four on the main bedroom. This is your bedroom. Now remember, this is a king bed. This is a king bed. So you can see you've got plenty of space. And then there's a nice little corner here where you can put the chair or oh, my beauty when you do my makeup i can just put the mirror okay the bathroom you got your own private balcony <laughs> morning uh -huh. this is going to become like a bush mm. oh. so it's going to give you a lot more privacy oh yeah oh King. They put a king in just to show you because a lot of people don't think the king will get Because we have a queen XL. Okay, so it'll be smaller than this, so you have more space. Okay. Here's the drawer. And sweet. Yes. Oh, baby. 
Go in. I want to see how special it is. You can both quite easily fit in here. Yeah, I know this. Uh, I'm like, Habib, come join me in the shower. Give <laughs> <laughs> okay. me the bag. Shall we been carrying my bag? Spacious. My stuff and your stuff, because currently we're sharing one. Yeah. Okay. You said you six? Yeah. <laughs> Please hold a bit here. I want to go to the closet, my favorite. Oh, you want to go? What am I wearing today? The space. That's the outfit of the day. I'm going to be doing my outfits of the day here. I'm wearing a dress from Superblitz. This is H&M. You're already seeing yourself in this house. Yes, <laughs> I'm already seeing myself in this house. This uh, coat is from Mango, bought it on Superblitz. Wearing my Sambas. Having my Gucci bag. Oh, that's, that's way more than this. Can I put my bags here? You've also got the drawers, which is nice. Yeah. So spacious. Okay. What do you think? I love it. I love it. I really love it. Well, we're still going. To another room. This one is the four bedroom. So these two bedrooms have got their own balconies. Serious. How many units are left here? We've got ten. Ten left. And people are already staying here. Mm. People are already in yes. You can see that when there's the uh -huh. people are moving in at the mm. end of the month, into that end one, uh -huh. the one next door got people, the mm. side's got people. Mm. Is that a much past? Yes. And then you have your other two bedrooms. Oh, so so on the bottom of the upstairs? Yes. In all of the units, all the bedrooms are upstairs. guys so i just came on here to close off this vlog uh i was supposed to go live yesterday but i couldn't because i had so much work so much so much editing um but i one thing that i don't want is that no matter how busy i get or we'd work from other uh social media platforms because i have a campaign from tiktok a campaign for instagram and a campaign for youtube so it gets too much but however i don't want to stop vlogging and i don't want to stop being consistent because you guys show me so much support so i'm so sorry my vlog is late i know it was supposed to come out yesterday and it only came out today uh please please forgive me i will do better and i want to try and release my vlogs early 
Sunday morning. I'm, I'm gonna try. I'm not promising, but definitely I want to stick to Sunday. So I really wanted to apologize for that. And also um, the brightness of my vlog. Even now I'm keeping this because uh, when I look at my I don't know what's wrong with my camera when I look at it it looks bright enough but when I edit I can see that um, it is too bright um, so I, I am going to work on the settings and the last thing is um, we went to a few house viewings I obviously you guys only saw one but they are all more more like it's almost the same thing because we have a specific look that we're looking for and i loved the house that you guys saw and i loved the other houses that we saw as well um the one that you saw was my favorite the only thing that i didn't like was the bedroom and how it's i like the walk-in closet but i i wish like there was a closet this side and this side instead of being just a wall and a closet and i don't like that it has such a small space in the bedroom i'm gonna put a b-roll like i wish like I want to put like a, a bench in front of my bed and I want to put like a chair there by the corner and like I want space in my bedroom. There are two things that I'm not willing to compromise on and that is the bedroom and the kitchen. The other stuff I know I won't get 100% of what I want but just those two things have to be really really beautiful for me and then we can decide. But yeah guys my mentor my my maternal instincts are kickboxing me and i think they're kickboxing my husband as well his paternal instincts because like every house that we view we think about oh will our kids like this will our kids enjoy this and was this house you guys didn't see it, we viewed it and when we came in downstairs like there's three bedrooms upstairs and one bedroom downstairs and the bedroom downstairs is small and then when i saw it i just thought of a nursery i'm like oh my word it would be so nice to have a nursery downstairs and um so that the bottles are closer everything is just closer when i'm watching the tv the baby can be sleeping <laughs> meet God God hears me and then when I'm watching TV um, the baby can be sleeping and I could be like catching up on YouTube or I can be just editing on the couch while the baby's sleeping and then I won't be too far to go and check on I don't have to go all the way down upstairs to check on the baby I can be cooking in the kitchen and the nursery will be over there I can hear the baby if they cry I know I probably have like a baby monitor and stuff but still gee, I was just I was just feeling like oh my god like I'm such a different girl from the person I was like five years or when I met my husband or like ten years ago like everything that, that we do now centers around will this suit our kids because <laughs> um there were bedrooms like the house you guys saw the bedrooms are next to each other and then the sliding doors like you can open this sliding door and then go to the next room I'm thinking oh my god if we have like kids they can just visit each other they can just go and hang out on the balcony and then go back to their rooms and what else and my husband is obsessing over school fees like i feel like every conversation we have he just oh my god and, and our kids school fees i can just pay and because he wants to handle that part the school fees part i can just pay school fees and if i save this much we'll have this much for school fees and then if we're walking around our neighborhood we see a school oh maybe our kids can have can play this sport okay cool they can go to this school i'm like you know what you know what i don't know it's just i love that this kids topic is happening so seamlessly like we're not we're not pregnant we're not even really trying i don't want to lie to you guys but i love how <sighs> either i don't know how to explain it guys because i always used to ask people what you like what made you want children do you understand like what made you want to have a baby like what came over you like what were you thinking because with, with me i never had that feeling like honestly i thought oh i want to get married in, in but now like this feeling that i'm getting it's just it's like it's like breathing it just comes to me and i just think about it like oh if i'm friends with this person then our kids can play together <laughs> oh oh in the morning when we're walking oh if i'm leaving the house i can drop off the kids here at school like it's the most it's the weirdest thing i don't know how to explain it and as time goes by like it's the more it's it, it's it just 
but the feeling just gets stronger and stronger and stronger and we just get excited over this new role that is not so far it's not here but it's not like i'm not gonna say i know we're not gonna wait like another three years or four years to have kids but yeah i was just saying with you this house viewing process is just it was something that is magical and something so strong I've, I've always known that i want kids i've always known but maternal instincts oh my god they are kickboxing me like they're not just punching they're kickboxing me like it's a karate <sighs> but yeah guys i can't wait mine <laughs> i can't wait i can't wait but yeah i just wanted to share that um life is something else guys life is something else like yeah you think you want something and something else pops up and i'm just glad that we have something so beautiful to look forward to to the future you know <laughs> okay guys let me go i have i have makeup on because i have to film a um uh, i can't even tell you the brand but next week you'll know because i'm going live on thursday Today is Monday, the, I'm going live on the 25th of April. So by then you'll know the new brand that I'm working with. I'm so excited. So I'm shooting for them today and I'm quite late. Um, but yeah, let me go guys. I love you guys so much. If you enjoyed, only if you enjoyed this vlog, please do like that. Give me a big thumbs up and say, hey girly, you did a great job. I enjoyed this one. And if you love or like this channel, please uh so do subscribe i think we own 109,000. thank you for subscribing for those who did and guys thank you for liking i know last time i was like oh you guys don't like my videos and you guys really showed up thank you please do like the video please do subscribe and i'll see you guys on my next one i'm out boo 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 <laughs> yeah, guys bye bye <laughs>